this uh, video segment we are going to show you how to um, copy and paste uh, channel settings. So what we're going to do is zoom in a little bit here to this area of the board which it says channel copy load save. Um, what we are going to do is um, we had already set up a, a kick drum uh, in channel 3 and what we're going to do is go back out and uh, select channel 3 and let's say that this was a starting point let, let you know for giggles let's just say it was a male vocal and we want to copy that um, into some other channels um, that we've got male vocals that we want to start with so what we're going to do is we've got it selected we're going to go in here and say copy and now all of a sudden all the Things are flashing saying, where do you want to paste me? Please, please, please. So what we're going to do is with these, we're going to paste them into 14, 15, and 16. And as we hit those, you see now that they've stayed on solid and they're not flashing anymore. Um, let's see if uh, you can see that. Yeah, we'll zoom out here a little bit so you can see all of them. Um, and what we'll do is we hit load, bada bing, bada bong, and we're done. So now 14, 15, and 16, um, if we zoom out just a little bit here, um, you can see the fat channel settings up there. Um, they're all the same as we hit the selects on 14, 15, and 16, as well as the same on 3. And then as you go through your different channels, um, if there was anything loaded in those, then it would show up differently. Um, but that's how easy it is to um, copy and kind of move stuff around um, as far as... Um, you know, preset settings on the board, or if you've got something dialed in that you really like, uh, that you've got set up for one, you can do that on one and copy it over to as many channels as you want. Um, not just on this board, but you can copy them all the way over to here, or as you, you know, can see if we hit the select and then we hit the copy button, it's also flashing everything up on the, um, the auxes. Um, if we pull back out here, you can see those flashing as well. Um, it's flashing on the subgroups and also on the mains. So you can pretty much paste that setting um, anywhere and onto any channel on the board, um, which I think is just a stinking cool feature.